Hello friends, happy Monday. It's a new week. Vlog just went live from last week. We're chilling, we're grooving. I did a 6K run, which sucked. It was supposed to be 10 and I gave up. It just wasn't that kind of a day. Um, but we gotta go drop film off from the shoot. Gotta get groceries. Just, you know, Monday shit. This is what we're wearing. Okay, this fit I'm actually hyped on. I, uh, always trying to figure out how to wear these vintage military cargoes on. I've literally never worn them out because I can never love the fit. And this time I like it. So. Vintage military cargoes, the Clark Wallies, duh. This is a Ronning Fisherman knit I forgot I owned. It's black. It's just like cotton knit. Um, EOT cap. That's it. I kind of like this one. Also, we just got back from the desert yesterday, and look at how nasty the car is. Like, ew. A very exciting package just came. It is the. The finals of the sweatshirts, like our cotton sweatshirts, like bread and butter type shit. Last time we released these were last fall, which all we had was green. And through some factory changes and other stuff, we're now made in Canada for these, which is amazing. Um, quality is um, beautiful. Anyways, production's almost done, so I got the photo shoot samples to be able to like, shoot and stuff. Also, first piece I'm seeing that comes in our new uh, poly bags, which has every other Thursday. A little bit biodegradable warning because it's biodegradable. That's right. So I'm super excited. Frosted. Oh, it just like looks good. Like you see that and you're like, fuck me up. Okay, let's do it. Let's open it. All right. First time on. Oh. Beautiful. Beautiful. A beautiful like crop almost fit. Like that looks so fire. I don't know what else I can say. Like a slightly dropped shoulder, thick 40. 400 GSM cotton, I think, something like that. Anyways, you're like fucking so sexy. You've got those tight cuffs, like sits at the perfect spot. This is a medium, I'm 6'2". I'm so hyped. All right, let's try on the other colors. This is the gray color's a little bit weird on the camera. It's just like a dark heather gray. Let me see. There, that's better. This is the gray, heather gray, still beautiful crop. And then the blue. Just like a classic navy, you can't really go wrong. But the colors look all together, that's nice. Hello friends, who knows what day it is, but um, I'm on the forever hunt of like good vintage hats. And since I own a old Land Rover Discovery, obviously I had to try and find some good Land Rover hats. And they're hard to find, first of all, because there's not a lot of many, not a lot of them. But second, this is like the second or third one I found, and usually they, either the fit is like garbage, like I have a black one that just doesn't fit well. Fucking dumplings are ready as I'm filming this. Dumps. Okay. This shit. Fly by Jing. He sent us like all three of whatever flavors. Fucking amazing. This is the Szechuan Chili Crisp. I literally put it on everything. Um, we have like a dried powder one that goes on a bunch of shit. We like roast vegetables with it. Oh, put that shit on the dumps. Oh my God. Oh, whoa. Oh. I burnt my mouth. Okay, what I was saying. I don't, it's hard to find good ones that like fit nicely. Let me see if I can find the shitty one in question. This is, this is where all my hats are, by the way. This one. So many that I bought on eBay, I just don't even wear because I have such a massive dome, it doesn't fit. Okay, this one, black with the rope, it's kind of fire, right? Like, you'd think it'd be amazing. Fits like shit, let me show you. Like, why does it look like that? It's like, on a little triangle? It's just not good. So, I'm on the forever hunt, and I found this one on eBay, for steel, and it's green, which is even better, and the fit, the shape is actually nice, I think, um, but it's so heavily stained, like that's disgusting. And I'm gonna try and fix it. So I got a bucket, we're gonna get some laundry soap and we're gonna soak it and wash it, hand wash it for a while, see if that helps. What the hell is this? See if that helps and then, uh, then we'll go from there. But right now, I'm gonna eat my dumplings. Step one, water. And then we need laundry soap. Put it in. Now I've never actually done this, um, but I've seen TikToks of people do it, so it should be fine. Okay, I didn't put much because I didn't want it to like go crazy. I'm gonna leave that in the sink, Sarah's gonna hate that. 
hat in the bucket. And basically, I'm just gonna like massage it up and try and, you know, get, get after that. And then I'm just gonna let it soak and hopefully those nasty fucking stains are gonna come out. Okay, I think the, the nasty hat is gonna be done. Well, I'm just bored of waiting, so it, it, we're gonna say it's done. I'm just gonna like wring out some of the water and then I'm just gonna leave it out in the sun to dry. I think it came off. I don't really know until it dries, but it looks good. That's the color of the water. You can't really see, but it's like yellow. Ew. Nasty. Sarah does not like it. All right, here's the deal. Where did I put you? Hello. Here's the deal. Um, Crewnecks dropping this week. No, next week. Very exciting. They're finished this week. Gonna go to fulfillment. That's great. Problem was, these were supposed to drop with the hats, which everyone was very excited about. I was very excited about because we haven't had snap packs in like I want to say a year. Like it's been a long time. But anyways, I get them. Fucked. Literally fucked. Like. I'm so frustrated. I was so excited for these because they're so nice. They fit great. They got great colors, embroidered logo. It just, they look great. I was very pleased. Samples were are approved. Everything was good. Ordered 1,500 hats, which is like a lot of hats. And I get the, the, the majority of them go to fulfillment. And then like one of each comes to me so that I can shoot them and stuff. I get the one of each. They're wrong. The sizing is just wrong. I don't know what happened, but they are all like four centimeters smaller in circumference, which doesn't sound like a lot, but it doesn't even fit on my head four centimeters smaller. So completely fucked. Just absolutely wrecked. All 1500 pieces are either going to be destroyed or sent back because they're just like, they're just not good. They like, not only is it smaller, the stitching was messed. Like, I don't know what happened. Not good. So, yeah. So I have a new manufacturer starting all over, um, which means the hats aren't gonna release until like mid-summer. In the positive news, we are gonna have dad hats release alongside these hats. So whatever, we'll have snapbacks, unstructured, low profile, blah, blah, blah. Also gonna have dad hats. It's for the best. This is a better hat. It's a better quality hat. It's a better manufacturer. But I'm just like, so close, so close. Anyways, I'm off to the film store because I gotta put the film in for the shoot the other day, yesterday. Uh, we shot the Korean X, which was great. We did mostly digital, but then I shot some editorial stuff on film. Uh, so I gotta go drop that off because it's dropping next week. I'm very excited about that. That is great. They're made in Canada. They're sexy. They got no issues. We're hyped on those.